Hey guys! I'm here to film a how to stay motivated video. I wrote a blog post on the subject this morning, but I figured that I would film a video for you as I know that a lot of people would rather watch a video than read a blog post, so I'm going to get right into it. So first thing I want to talk about is what is motivation? Motivation is defined as two things. One, it is it could be the reasons um, for which one is acting a certain way. Number two is a general desire to do something. So now that we know what motivation is, where do we find it? I mean, we can't really find it. You can't open a book or uh, browse through a website and just automatically find motivation. Something could inspire you or motivate you to do something, but really that probably won't be too long lasting. So you have to find motivation within you. It usually is there's something that sparks something within you that just gets you motivated and you just feel like you can do this, like you just can do it. The third thing is, why am I losing my motivation? The I think the main reason for this, and I think that everyone um, goes through this or has this problem along their journey, I think it is because we tend to lose sight of our goals. Um, we have to make sure that our goals are tangible, that they are goals that we can achieve in the near future. It doesn't have to be like this week. The fourth thing I want to talk about is how do I get it back? So you get it back by making new goals. You can also um, like revisit your goals because as you're changing along your journey, your goals should also be changing with you because something that you might have like a goal that you might have set for yourself um, when you first started your journey might not be relevant anymore so you want to make sure that your goals are relevant and that they are um, goals that will keep you going now I want to share five tips with you guys five tips that I think will help keep you motivated number one is to keep it fun Change up your routine, um, maybe have a little notebook that you write down all of your workouts in and then um, that will give you like a bank of workouts that you can refer to in the future. Also you can make it like a little date with yourself so that that's fun too. Like it's time for yourself, by yourself, you're working on yourself so that should motivate you. Number two is make fitness a priority. I mean, you go about your day and you do all these things and you kind of forget about your health and fitness or you're working and you're busy and you don't have time. Well, I think that time shouldn't never be an issue. You probably always have an extra 20 or 30 minutes in your day that you can just go and do a quick little workout, you don't have to go to the gym and spend hours, just find a little bit of time to work out. Number three is to take progress pictures because our brains have a silly way of making us believe that we're not making progress or that we're not losing weight or and I think that's because we see ourselves every single day. So. Our brains kind of just like adjust but don't really, I tend to say my brain doesn't keep up with my body because it sort of forgets that I have made progress and I am way further ahead than I was when I started. So I think that progress pictures help a lot. My fourth thing is clothing. I think that you should have clothing that you use solely for working out. If you don't feel like working out, you just throw on those clothing and 
all of a sudden it just seems like you feel like working out. Like I do that sometimes, like some days I'm just like, oh my god, I just really, I can't see myself working out. So I just put on my workout clothes and then all of a sudden I notice that I'm in my workout room starting my workout. You should give that a try, maybe that'll help you. The fifth and I think most important tip would be to love yourself. I know that that is easier said than done, but I think that you can take steps to achieve that and I think that that will be your number one motivator because if you love yourself then you will be more likely to treat yourself the way you deserve. So I think that that should be enough to keep you going from day to day. I know that you might need to work on that and that is another um, challenge on its own but I really really think that it, you will benefit from it and that it will help you in the long run. I hope that you guys have enjoyed this video and if you would like to see similar videos to this please give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe to my channel. Um, I will leave links to all of my social sites below so feel free to check those out and I shall see you guys soon for another video. Bye!